Oh, hella bit, it's your boy Big Big B, and we back for another edition of Big Big Business. Today, we are back with yet another video, and this time, I'm back with five fragrance tricks you should steal to smell better. Listen, when you walk into a room not only looking, but also smelling your best, it's going to give you an unfair competitive advantage as your confidence level is going to go through the roof. It's going to have you feeling like nothing can stop me, I'm all the way up. Listen, man, your confidence level should be all the way through the roof. I'm expecting that. But when you are not smelling your best, it's going to make you feel like you're not living your best life. Look, I know what you're thinking. B, with social distancing, no one cares, right? Wrong. Listen, man, I told you smelling good is going to impact your overall morale and self-esteem. In times like this, it's really important to keep things as normal as possible. Listen, man, social distancing and quarantining can have a major impact on your mental health. And keeping things regular by smelling good, if that's what it's going to take to fight it, then so be it. Now, some of these tips, tricks, and hacks may vary or greatly differ from what you know or think you know about wearing a fragrance, so feel free to try along at home. So fragrance tip number one is pretty much a no-brainer, and I like to start these lists out with this way because common sense may not always be common practice, and that first tip and trick is to bathe and shower on a consistent basis. Yes, eliminating some of those germs and grime away from your body is the best way to start your fight against smelling horrific. Listen, man, I know a lot of you are sitting on the couch and have not washed since quarantine started. <laughs> no, man, all jokes aside though, listen, you don't wanna fall into that hole where you are not taking care of yourself. Make sure you are showering and bathing on a consistent basis, even if you're not wearing fragrances because it'll keep you smelling better. So listen, once your canvas is clean, you're ready to take on the world. Well, almost. The second fragrance trick you should steal is to wear the right fragrance for the right occasion. Taking a deeper dive here, one of the things you should do is really learn what you like. That way you're going to fully understand what's going to work for you in that special occasion. And one way to do that is to holler at my people over at Lux SB. Yes, man, Lux SB. Shiny. For as little as $15 a month, you can start exploring the world of fragrance. And if you want to step your game up a bit more and explore the niche world of fragrance because you're fancy, then for $18 a month, you can also do that. Let's say you want to explore a fragrance house like Mancera. Well, if you're not familiar with Mancera, then perfect. Let me tell you all about it. Again, for $18 a month, you can explore the world of niche perfumery. You're going to get something in the mail that looks like this. Let me open this thing. It's protected. Once you're in your package, you're going to see something like this, man. A welcome card for being a member of the team where they're going to help you find your perfect fragrance. Listen, man, you've probably seen stuff like this before because you watched my video and you heard me talk about Lux SB. All right, man, so your monthly subscription is going... Oops, dropping stuff all over the place. Listen, man, your monthly subscription is going to come in a box like this. So you are triple protected, all right? Boom, you pull it out. And then this is your traditional twist to spray format. You go ahead and pull this thing out. And this one here is Mancera Au Lemon Mint. Now the House of Mancera has a ton of fragrances available and Lux SB has partnered with them to make sure that you can try their line out and determine what works best for you. Listen, man, again, this process is really simple. After you grab your fragrance, you can head to their website. You can rate your fragrance. You can also choose the particular time of month you would like your fragrance to come in. And if you're not familiar, you can explore from all of their fragrances that are available. Now, Mancera fragrances aren't the most expensive fragrances out there, but they also aren't the cheapest. For about 170 bucks or so, you can pick up a 120 ml bottle, but again, my people over Lux SB make it really affordable. You can also try their fragrances there, and once you see what you like, you can also head over and buy a full bottle. But because you're rocking with your boy, you can go ahead and use the code Big Big Business, and you're going to save $5 off your first month order, no matter if you're exploring the world of niche or designer perfume. Fimery. So, <laughs> the savings, my friend, well, we've passed them along to you. 
And speaking of passing things along to you, we'll come back to that. Now the third trick on my list today may make you question everything you know about life, all right? Well, at least the world of fragrance. This is probably something that will uh, definitely contradict everything you know about fragrance and how to wear a fragrance as I'm going to tell you something that I found on the World Wide Web. But seriously, man, all jokes aside, this one is a bit different, so I want you to hear me out. Now, I came across this tip a few years ago from a company called La Centures, which is a London-based fragrance house, and pretty much what they say is to not apply your fragrance on pulse points. Traditionally speaking, you'll hear us say, hey, apply your fragrance on pulse points, as it will help them project more. Will it? Maybe. Here's the thing, man, so they pretty much say that applying your fragrances on pulse points will make the fragrance run out quicker as it's going to heat up more and therefore dry out a bit more. Traditionally speaking, you may have heard to apply your fragrances on pulse points, but La Centura said, hey, you should apply your fragrance on a greater surface area. Some key places that I personally recommend are going to be on your shoulder. That way when you're walking past someone, they'll catch that whiff and they say, you sir, smell good. You're going in for a hug, you sir, smell good. This is is a easy tip for you to smell better. Also, you can apply on your forearms if you like me and you use a lot of this. <laughs> then the fragrance will go all over the place. Or man, if you just you know, got your arm around your girl, boom, she smells it, you're giving people high fives throughout the day, boom, they smell it and increasing your compliment factor. So how I get so many compliments? You just learned it, don't ask me again. <laughs> My next trick is to use a multi-layer fragrance approach. Yes, multiple layers in terms of making your fragrance boom, pop, and stand out will help you smell better, much better than the competition. Competition? Yes, other people. Listen, man, so it is a very simple approach, all right? Use a multi-layered approach, which is one, having a good fragrance prime skin, which means to moisturize, all right? So whatever the type of moisturizer you're using, it should be unscented. Why? Because using scented moisturizers, lotions, etc., is going to compete with your fragrance overall, and we don't want that. Another thing you could do in terms of a multi-layering effect is to mix some of your fragrances. Now, I've personally talked about fragrance combinations that have worked for me and those around me, and obviously a lot of you as well based on the feedback. I will leave those videos linked and listed down below for those of you who have not had an opportunity to check those out or need a bit of refreshing, but that is another great multi-layer fragrance approach. So the fifth and final trick to smell better is one that you're gonna have to do at home. I told you that you might want to follow along. Listen, man, my good people over at Lux SB and Mansetta are going to hook one of you up with a fragrance. Yes, man, you can get a full-size bottle of one of the fragrances that they offer, all right? This is all you have to do. Again, I told you to follow along at home. All right, all you have to do is drop your Instagram name down below and be a follower on Instagram of Big Beard B and also Lux SB. I will verify that by randomly selecting one of you um, within one week of today, all right? We're gonna drop the video one week of today. I will go on and figure out who is the winner. Winner, chicken dinner, all right? And I will go ahead and leave that link then listed down below once we go ahead and determine who the winner is. So, best of luck to you. You're going to steal your chance to win from everyone else by going ahead and doing it. So make sure you do that quickly, all right? So there are my five tips to smell better. Well, the fourth one was, you know, me helping you smell better in real life. So once again, man, my people over at Lux SB are hooking you up with the opportunity to smell good, all right? All you have to do is do what I told you to do. You can also hit the link down below to check out their website and view a ton of their fragrances that they have, man. They have hundreds available and also they have a number of different fragrance manufacturers that they work with. And this, sir, just happens to be Mansetta. All right, man, so hopefully you had the opportunity to win because you do, hopefully you win. I want you to win, not the other person watching. I want you, all right? There you have it. As always, I'm your boy, Big B. B. Don't hit the like, comment, and subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend that we are back again. And you already know what to do. Hit the goddamn bell. I mean, you may also want to participate in the giveaway. <laughs>